Hello guys, welcome to my channel. This is the 14th tutorial in this course and in this tutorial we're going to see how we can slice hashes and obtain values uh, from hashes in Perl. So I've got a script opened up here. It's called hashes underscore slice and in this script on line number 3 I have created a hash called players. I've used the percent symbol to create the hash and uh, this is uh, similar to the uh, players hash that we worked with in the last tutorial is just that I've added another key value pair for uh, K and Ishikori so this one has four key value pairs uh, rank one belongs to Novak Djokovic and then at number two we have Roger number three is Andy and number four is K so you know this was uh, the rankings at the time of uh, you know making the script now uh, the rankings have changed uh, Andy Murray is the number two player in the world Roger Federer is at number three and I guess if I'm not wrong, uh, Stanislas Wawrinka is at number four, and Nishikori is maybe at six. So anyway, uh, coming back to the topic of slicing hashes. So let's say you want to fetch a bunch of values from this hash, you know, not just one. So if you were to fetch just one value, then you could do it uh, the way I demonstrated in the last tutorial by, you know, creating uh, a temporary scalar reference by using the dollar symbol and then, you know, just typing uh, the key within curly braces. But here, let's say you want uh, to, you know, fetch all values, you know, all uh, four names, Novak, Roger, Andy and K. Uh, then uh, the way you do that is by creating an array variable because if you were fetching multiple values in a single statement then you would get the values in a list and uh, the data structure in Perl that is designed to work with lists is the array data structure so you would have to create or you know store the output in uh, an array so I have done that on line number five I have created an array variable called my underscore list I put uh, the equal to symbol and then since uh, we are fetching values in list form we have to use the add the rate symbol here you know for slicing this hash so uh, if you were fetching one value then you use a dollar symbol with the hash name but here since we are fetching multiple values we have to use the add the rate symbol because as I said we're going to get the output in list form so uh, players is the name of the hash you put the add the rate symbol first and then within curly braces you just type in uh, your keys and uh, you could either type 1 comma 2 comma 3 comma 4 here if you wanted all four values or you could just put two dots between 1 and 4 and Perl would sort of autocomplete and you know get you the other two keys in between so this is going to do the job for us the next thing that we have to do is to display the the values that we fetched so that we're going to do that using the print statement on line number seven top tennis players in the world and we're just going to output the contents of the array variable my list which we have just created right so I'll make sure the script is saved I'll press F5 to run it so there we go in the output we see top tennis players in the world Novak Roger Andy and K we see all four values and if instead of the two dots here if I would put a comma then we should only see Novak and K's name because uh, we are selecting values for only two keys one and four and I'll run the script and there we go we only see Novak and K so that's it for this uh, tutorial I hope you guys had fun watching this one and you may subscribe to my channel if you haven't already I'm gonna see you in the next video till then take care